Hi everyone. Uh, as you can see, it's not garbage. It's actually, uh, it looks very, very closely to, to concrete, but it's harder. It's sturdier, it's fire retardant, fireproof. Um, it confers a lot of the, it's, oh, you don't have to worry about wood ants. It's one thing here that, <laughs> that we worry about a lot. And uh, if the uh, minister knows we started this on Thursday night, really, we unpacked the container. And today we finished the structure already. The next thing to put on is the roof and the windows and, and so on. So it's quick, it's durable, it's very flexible. You can add on and put off uh, according to, to what you want. And uh, I like this stone finish. It has, a nice very, it has a nice rustic stone finish, but you can travel text it. You can put cement board and, and paint it. You can finish it really any way that you, uh, that you want. So it's quick, it's really affordable, uh, it's light and very, very, very durable. Average assembly time uh, with all the fittings between seven to 10 days with a crew of four. Uh, this one here is three bedrooms, but it's the same size, the cost won't vary. This house here is three tons of plastic. So that's gonna take a tremendous amount of plastic um, to, to, to manufacture. And a facility here will, can be transformative. So the plastic and the technology and the material came from Colombia. People have definitely reached out um, I woke up this morning with quite a few messages in our, in our social media uh, inbox pages. People are really interested. Um, they do have questions, like, uh, I don't want to live in a garbage house, you know, those kinds of things. But it, as you can see, it's definitely not a garbage house. It goes through an industrial process the same way that cement goes through an industrial process. Does it smell at all? Uh, no, no, it doesn't. It's, it's, it's inert. It doesn't smell, it doesn't release any toxic fumes. It's, Oh, that's another thing is I've seen some comments. People say, no, this can give me cancer. This is, <laughs> this is made from materials that we see, that we use every day, right? There are materials that we use in our, in our construction um, technology, not, not, not us, but that we, use, that we use like PVC that are a lot more, that are a lot more toxic, that polyvinyl chloride. This is things that we live with uh, every day. It's just reconverted, upcycled, you can call it, to produce, uh, to produce a really, really affordable, flexible uh, building structures. And uh, it's not just housing, that's anything is possible. You can do health centers, classrooms, uh, housing, industrial storage. It's really the possibilities are endless.